Are you getting a hold of how powerful hope is? Do you know that the reason why so many people never receive from God is because they are uh, inundated, overwhelmed by their natural circumstances? That may be you today. You've been overwhelmed by what's going on and you can't see past tomorrow. You can't see past uh, the, 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 the problems that you're experiencing today. You can't see past your sickness. You can't see past your fear. And that's what, that's, that's what you think about all the time. That's what you imagine all the time. Child of God, you are, you're having hope in the wrong thing. It's not really good hope. You're actually having dread and fear because of that wrong imagination. It's time to change that. Go to what God has said. You need to, if, if, if you like, well, I can't do this. It doesn't ever change for me. You need, to, you need to stay in that promise and you need to keep bringing, you know, imagining you receiving that. Imagine what it looks like. You keep reading that until it produces a new picture in your heart, a new picture in your life. You've got to have a new picture so that faith can cause it to come to pass. And so until you have grasped that picture, in your thinking, in your heart, in your mind, and can begin imagining uh, uh, what it looks like to have the promise of God, then you won't receive it. So start imagining the good things today, and that's life in 90.